You look beautiful. Be happy. Our baby Mila is here. And we're gonna ask her some hard hitting questions. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, right. <laughs> so. Welcome to. See? <laughs> okay. Alright, Andrew. Alright, I get it. I get it. I get it. I'm hungry, so. Is that what I said just now? That I was hungry? <laughs> is that what you. Is that, what, is that the translation for. <laughs> the bull crap that I just did? <laughs> I'm hungry. Hi, I'm Andrew Spence. And me, I am Karina Arius Hyphenation Brand. Why would you give him my full name? Alright. You gave him my full name! No, it's coming. Hi, my name is Andrew Barrington Carlisle Spence. Don't you dare act like that's not your name. Because I will whip out your birth certificate. I know where it Yo, is. Yo, it's not cool, man. Ain't nobody call me Carla. Don't you call me Carla, man. Listen, guys. We just wanted to come here together today to welcome you to this channel, Bambi's Gift. Bambi. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, we have a lot of videos that are going to be coming your way. And um, I hope you stay tuned. Ask us any questions that you'd like down in the comments. Say anything, you know, whatever you I like. I got questions. What? what about me? I got questions. This is practice when they actually start okay. asking us questions. You have to you have to raise your hand, Andrew. Timothy, please. Who the hell si Are you sleeping with Timothy? Andrew, what? <laughs> <laughs> Who is Timothy? Okay, what's your question? So, my question is. If you could only have one car the rest of your life, what car would that be? And I'll tell you mine. I think it would be an Audi S7. Dang. I've been obsessed with that car for a long time. I don't know if you guys say Audi, Audi, I say Audi. But Damn, if you girl. know how to say it correctly, just let me know. Damn, alright, so she's giving me some work to do clearly. Well, you know, it, now is a good time to start, Andrew. Um, you know, just kidding. Ladies, work for your own things, okay? You don't need to rely on a man. Come on. That's so 1950s. Oh, okay. Anyway. Um, so, what would be your car? Right. I got this. Okay, you tell me. The Skyline. Nissan Skyline. Which year? Come on. Come on. Yeah, come with it. Which year? 1995. Close. Six. No. Four. No. Seven? Yes. Oh, whatever. 1997. You can ask me a question. So you want tattoos? Yeah, I want, so check me out. I want to get, just in letters, Memento Mori, right here. You can ask me what that means later. I'm not going to explain it. But I want that. I also want, I want a handprint of my little girl Mila, our little girl Mila, right here on, on my chest, right over my heart. I also want, um... Don't you want an eyeball here? <laughs> no, I don't. No, no. <laughs> Hell no. Anyway, my turn. You're supposed to ask me something. I did ask you something. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're right. All right, I'm going to ask you something. All right, so, um, if I were to, so, you get a call one day. Mm -hmm. It's a collect call, and it's from me, because I'm in jail. What am I in jail for? Okay, you're in jail because you're filming without a permit. Dope. Okay, you probably you're probably right. Where would I be filming? Like what? Where? Where? Where would it be? Like let's you get colorful. You would probably sneak into, um, like a, a studio, like in Hollywood or something. A studio in Hollywood? Maybe in Miami. Miami's closer. So Cream. Yeah. You won't go to jail for that. They just kick you out. Okay. Uh. Okay. I got this. New York. You know, New York is really bad with permits. They're pretty bad with it. A slaughterhouse. Yeah. That's pretty bad too. Yeah, they'll they'll That's throw bad. you in jail. Yeah, they'll throw you in jail without for that. thinking. Yeah, I would definitely film a slaughter slaughterhouse too. I would do that. <laughs> that. Yeah, they'll throw you in jail. All right, so you know where I think if you get if I got a collect call from you and you were in jail, I would think that was because you freed a pig. Because like you went Oak Jaw. You saw Oak Jaw. I was about to say you went and saw Oak Jaw, and then you're like, I have to free a pig. You went and freed a pig. 
Listen, and they put you in jail. If you guys haven't seen Oja, it's really what does she have? Mealerton. That is not her name, by the way. Mealerton. She's packing up her stuff. She's leaving. Yo, us. No way. Just like my little brother when he was six years old. Hi, David. Yo. Your older David, sister David. misses you. Call me. Okay. Okay. All right, you got any question? You got a question for me now? Okay. Why do you Sorry. love me? Why do I like you? No, you don't like. That's me. That's so heavy. Why do you love me? That's such a heavy. Keep it light. No. I, why are you saving? Why are you giving them the good stuff? Answer I, I, me. I can tell you right now, but why are we giving them the good stuff? We gotta it's make them work for I it. I want the good stuff right now. <laughs> then hit the record button. I'll tell you. You answer me right now. Oh my god. Or else why are you trying to give them the good stuff? I love you. Okay. I love you above all things. Because she has the most beautiful hands I've ever seen on a woman. Last week, she went, she got her nails done for the first time in like... In months. In months, it okay? Was in months. In months. And it's all good because she always keeps her nails nice and trim, but she, she usually, she didn't keep any paint on. But since we're because parents now... when we met, I always had my nails like... Oh my God. Really Lit. nice to a T. Lit. Yeah. But listen, it's all good. I still love her hands. But she got them done last week. And listen, she had this lovely beautiful chocolate colored it was like she went to the chocolate factory the Willy Wonka chocolate factory dipped her hands in the chocolate pulled them back out and bam on her nails and it was beautiful it was sexy I wanted to eat them shits this is why I love her I love her hands and that's really like they're just so beautiful and feminine looking oh my god they're just I just love Yo, my armpit stain please oh my god no right. it's because Sorry. it's really hot it's, it is very hot we turn off the AC because we care about quality Koalas. Koalas. Yes. Koalas, okay? Yes. So, yeah. So, yeah. That's why I love you. I hear you. And you're so the most compassionate woman that I've ever met in my entire life. That's sweet. The most compassionate. What's going on? What's happening? What? I don't know. Okay. Usually, usually it's like that. Yeah, got there it. we go. Yeah, we got it. We worked it out. Worked together. Oh my god, I think you're gonna break the back. Break it! Break it! If someone came to you, I said, check me out. I'm going to give you $5 million to move anywhere you want in the world. Mm -hmm. But when you go there, it's going to be the last house that you buy, the last place that, and the last place that you're going to live. If you live there the rest of your life, what would, where would you go? You got $5 million cash. Cash. I, I feel like I should say Colombia or El Salvador because that's where my parents are from. But I've always wanted to go to like Sweden or Norway and live there. Pick one though. You gotta pick one. You can't I live can't in two just places. Pick Europe? You, Europe is a big place. Pick be 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 specific. Sweden or Norway. I would probably live around Lake Geneva in Switzerland. Switzerland, mm -hmm. okay. Wow, it's not Sweden or Norway, yeah, whatever. Okay, Switzerland. But yeah. So that's where you'd live rest of your life? Yeah. Dope. I just feel like it would be very peaceful. Yeah. And there's, you know, winters there. We that's live in true. South Florida, so there, there's nothing down here. No, nah, it's mean, hot as hell all year round. Yeah, the only, you know, fall change that we experience with, like, the leaves and stuff turning brown is when Hurricane Maria came, and uh, Maria, you mean Irma? Irma, who was Maria? Maria, Maria never came. Ne Maria hit Puerto Rico, and never hit us. First of all, what was up with all of these Latin names? First, you have Hurricane Irma, then Jose, Jose. and then Maria. What? What's going on? Well, and they yeah. all followed Harvey. Harvey Weinstein. Oh my gosh, where would you be? So, if someone gave me $5 million, cash. Cash. Oh, that's how his grandpa says it. My grandpa does, who are you talking about? Oh, let's not say any names. Yeah, no. But yeah, but, yeah. Not, one of my clients, he's literally like, he's become like my grandpa. He's like a grandpa. He's like a, he's like a yeah. really old Italian guy. He's literally, he's, um, he's, he's become awesome. my grandpa. Like, yeah. He's dope. He's so um, funny. He's hilarious. Um, he's a New Yorker. From Brooklyn. They're the best Cash. <laughs> cash. Uh, so, if someone gave me $5 million cash, and said I had to move and live in one place, it would definitely be Jamaica. Somewhere close to Duns River Falls. 
If you split the five million with me, I'll go with you. That's fine. Okay. It's yours. Um, yeah, it would be Denver Falls. You know, somewhere somewhere close to that. Or at least, at, at very minimum, like 10, 20 minutes driving distance. Because Jamaica is like, I have to go with what I know. And I've been to, I've been to Jamaica almost every year of my life. Mm -hmm. Up until 2012. I haven't been since then. Yeah. But Jamaica is like, just to me, it just feels, every time I go there, it feels like home. You know, my family's from there. We're all from there. I haven't been to too many places. Um... In my life, other than Jamaica, I mean, I've been to Canada, I've been to, like, the Dominican Republic. I would never live in the DR. It's terrible. Yeah, that he helped. has been to the DR, haven't you? I have, yes. That's where I would go, guys. So, yeah. I just want to say, I'm sure... It... She... Oh God, did she really hurt herself? No, she waited until I'm... oh, I made eye contact with her and started crying. Why would you make eye contact? Krita, because she's my baby. <laughs> All right, so, you know, y'all got to know us a little bit better. So, we had a couple questions. In co yeah, you know, we answered a couple questions for y'all, so. But leave us any questions that you may have. Sorry to cut you off. Um, and we will see you sooner than you think. But you, there's going to be a lot of great content coming from us. We're two very creative minds here. You'll see. I'll probably just chuck Andrew off the building or something. It, it's happened before. So. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> uh, but you know what has happened? Was I pregnant? No, this was when Mila was like a newborn. I had a yoga ball, right, because I had a home birth. And, you know, my midwife was like, yeah, you know, get on the yoga ball, bounce up and down, and that'll help with the labor. And after, you know, that happened, the birth of my child, Andrew and I were in Mila's room just playing around. <laughs> and all of a sudden, he got naked, first of all. I don't know why he decided to get naked. Throw me under the bus. Man. All right. And then he got on the ball and started bouncing. <laughs> I can't say. He ended up chucking himself ass first into the closet. <laughs> from the, I bounced from the ball and I landed into the closet ass first. Guys, but his, his body, like was folded in half so it just looked like two fingers were just like in the closet it was I'm sorry I mean yeah that did happen thanks for watching give yes. me give us your thumb and leave us a like okay let me lend the, you lent us an ear and an eye now we need a thumb that's right so we will be back oh and a sub yeah, you know, if you'd like. We'd no. love to have you. It's not if you'd like. No, no, no. Sub. If you don't sub, I'm going to come find you. He's not going to come find you. Listen, to win it. This is on camera, all right? I, I know I already told your dad about this, mm -hmm. but yesterday I cleaned the bathroom entirely from top to bottom. And Andrew's hair is beautiful. It's gorgeous. I love it. But he hasn't cut it in such a long time in years. And it's been so, over a year. Yeah, so... Yeah. Whenever he shakes it, like a bunch of little um, strands of hair just fall all over, right? And it just looks like a bunch of like black little fur balls, right? On the ground. Yeah, the more or less. Is white. More or less, yeah. So I clean everything up because he never cleans up, okay, after himself. Like the hairs, like when he shaves. I told him downstairs, and I'm telling you guys this in front of. No, I'm telling him in front of you guys. That if I see the bathroom get to that point again, this will be gone. Good luck. No, you good luck. Pencil in your cleaning, Andrew. Call the cleaning ladies, Andrew. Do something, but that bathroom is going to stay clean. Yes. That's right. I love you. Anyways. Squirt. Oh! oh. I no, like, I got you. I got you. Yeah, you I got, got, got you. All right, one more Before. time. One more time. I'm not gonna swear. No, no, I'm not. No, no, I won't do it. I'm gonna do it. How about this? <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Oh. No, no, he told me that. We have to go feed me. We're, I'm oh, hungry. Yeah. Yo, I have to feed myself. We have a, we have a baby that needs me? to eat, so we should, we should, we should get to that. Bye, y'all.